Well, I read a lot of science fiction when I was young. So people like Clark and Asimov and Heinlein. Most of the books Heinlein wrote were pretty straightforward, aimed at a pretty young audience. And so I read all of those. Then he wrote a couple where he wasn't aiming them at kids at all. They were actually represented more of his overall philosophy of life and concerns that he had. So both Stranger in a Strange Land and Moon is a Harsh Mistress were so different than what he'd written before, where Stranger in a Strange Land is so much more complicated than the other ones. It has a, somebody raised on Mars who hasn't been exposed to normal human society, and you know, he almost becomes like a religious figure, sort of figuring out new sense of human purpose and religion. And these books were supposed to help you think about how things worked in the real world. The word grok, I think, was first used in that book, and that seemed kind of cool, and it had, some liberal, almost hippie type moral values. This is the late 60s, early 70s. They had kind of this truth telling justice idea, you know, so it was kind of subversive. It's a pretty profound book, especially when you've read all those other books that you could just kind of plow through and you knew who the hero was, and the bad guy was. You know, the endings were always kind of tidy which in this case, Stranger in a Strange Land, the end is not that tidy. You kind of don't know what to think. The author's kind of telling you, hey, the future of humanity is pretty unclear as well.